My name is Susan Lambert and I represent the British Columbia Teachers Federation, 41,000 teachers in, in British Columbia who are sending you our solidarity, our support and our strength. We admire your courage in the face of the assaults of your government. We've been through it too and uh, we stand in solidarity with you. The attacks on teachers is global, it's worldwide and we have to in Canada stand strong in order to defend ourselves, our profession, and public education. Thank you for everything you're doing. Hi, I'm uh, Jim Eicher. I'm first vice president of the BC Teachers Federation. And just to let you know that our thoughts and our hearts are with you in your struggle to achieve a fair collective agreement in this round of bargaining. Uh, just to let you know that we support your uh, struggle and that we're with you in every way that we can be to fight off the uh, dictatorial concessions, contract stripping that your government is demanding uh, of you. So stay strong, stay united, we're here for you and just let us know what kind of other support that we can give you. Take care. Hello, I'm Wendy Turner. I'm a BCTF member at large and I'm also a teacher in the East Kootenai of British Columbia. I'm sending this message to all of my sisters and brothers in Ontario within the teaching profession, wishing you well and wishing you success. Stand strong. We know, we share your pain in knowing and understanding that the unethical use of legislation is what governments are using to strip our rights as professionals, but also our rights as Canadians. We are with you. Hi, my name is Mike Ball. I'm a teacher from Nanaimo, British Columbia, and a member at large of the BCTF executive. Bring you support from the teachers in BC who have faced many of the same fights you're facing today. We stand with you in solidarity, in support of public education. Thank you. I'm Denise Moffitt. I'm a teacher in Surrey, British Columbia. I'm also a member at large on the BCTF executive. I'd like to express my solidarity with teachers in Ontario. BC teachers know full well the negative impact of government interference in bargaining. Teachers across the country need to stand together and defend both the right to strike and the right to full free collective bargaining. Government interference in the bargaining process is unjustified and what the Ontario government is doing is wrong and simply can't stand. My name is Terry Mooring and I am uh, on the, a member at large on the executive of the BC Teachers Federation and I'm also a teacher from North Central British Columbia and I'm bringing a message of solidarity to Ontario teachers who are going through very similar struggles as we have in BC including the point that you're taking your provincial government to court over uh, legislation that is unconstitutional. We have done that in BC as well so it is uh, a tough road ahead uh, but uh, with through solidarity teachers in Ontario will uh, do what teachers in BC did which is uh, achieve a positive ruling from the courts and then continue the fight after that. So it is a continued fight that is shared by teachers across Canada and in particular in BC we sympathize with your struggle. Good luck. Paul Steer, President of the Delta Teachers Association in British Columbia and also a member at large on the Executive Committee of the British Columbia Teachers Federation. To our colleagues in Ontario currently in dispute with the government uh, we support you, I support you, teachers in Delta and British Columbia support you uh, in, in achieving for yourselves uh, a fair and reasonable uh, settlement of your disagreement with government. Always remember that you're supported by teachers, not only here but everywhere, because your struggle for uh, salary and benefits is also, and beyond that, a struggle for truth and justice in the workplace on behalf of all citizens of Canada your participants in the best dream, one of the best dreams uh, that our country has, and that's the dream of education. So good luck to you, we're with you, and wish you all the best. Hi, my name is Glenn Hansman. I'm the second vice president of the BCTF and a Vancouver teacher. I'm also a graduate of Chippewa Secondary School in North Bay, Ontario, so I know firsthand that there are amazing teachers in Ontario and you deserve to be treated much better than you are by your provincial government right now. In fact, the Ontario Liberal government seems to be taking a lot of its strategy and um, tactics out of the provincial government we have here in BC. In BC, we've had gross interference in collective bargaining over the past decade, 
and teachers have been pushing back as much as they can. So we're with you in your struggle. I have family that teaches in Ontario and I wish you well in all of your efforts. So keep resisting, keep the fires burning, and keep defending your rights to collective bargain and to defend public education in your province. I'm Joanna Larson, President of the Prince Rupert District Teachers Union and a member of the BCTF Executive Committee. Public education is the foundation of any healthy democracy. I stand here in solidarity today with teachers of Ontario because teachers are not the latest government moochers that your government and the BC government have been trying to make us out to be. We provide a valuable service and we need to stand up, stand strong and stand together. So good luck. Um, my name is David Kamlanovich. I'm a teacher in Kamloops and a member of the BCTF executive and um, I stand in solidarity with uh, teachers in Ontario and uh, certainly wish you all the best in uh, your fight against uh, uh, very terrible things that are happening uh, from the Ontario government. Uh, we in BC know all too well um, when governments uh, trample on our rights and um, we fully support your actions uh, whatever they may be and what your members decide. So hopefully um, everything turns out well and you get a fair and negotiated contract and we will stand with you until that happens. Thank you. Hi, it's Chris Stewart and I'm on the BC Teachers uh, Federation Executive, member at large. And I'm also a Vancouver secondary teacher. And I'm here just to say uh, I'm thinking of you, be strong, uh, don't give up and, uh, and stay united. Hi, my name is Frank Bonvino. I'm a local officer in Burnaby one of the larger locals in British Columbia. I just want to let everybody in Ontario know that the teachers in Burnaby stand behind you 110 uh, percent. You're doing the right thing, you're fighting the good fight. Uh, we've been through it here in, in BC. Uh, we know what it's like to deal with a government that doesn't want to negotiate and that wants to legislate. Uh, so we just want to let you know that we're in your corner and if you need anything, let us know.